I explained to him that the YMCA, the Young Men's Christian Association, and I what the Christian values are, and the YMCA was not upholding the Christian values like they say they are. He responded to me by saying that it would no longer be appropriate for us to practice with the team, and the YMCA would be in contact with our families, and we were sent home. In that moment, I knew that my efforts in bringing awareness to the fact that biological men were using the women's changing spaces in the YMCA. We love you, Abby! Yeah. 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 Weren't going to be enough. I did all the right things. I saw something that was obviously wrong, and I told someone. I told my, my coach. Someone who I am such trust. Someone who I am supposed to able, supposed to be able to come to do when I feel unsafe or scared. Instead, all of my feelings of unsafety, fear, and vulnerability were simply right in the wrong. I was uncomfortable changing, and were biological men were being allowed to undress in the same space as me and my underage teammates. Not only were my feelings discredited. But I was also removed from my spy, from my swim team, and banned from the YMCA. I am here in hopes that sharing my story will reach parents, future parents, coaches, churches, and members of the YMCA. share my story and for everyone that has come out to